Hello guys, welcome you all in a new video and this video is totally dedicated for the consumers who is using Samsung Android smartphone of any series like A series, F series, J series, M series, any series of Samsung Android smartphone if you are using and if your Samsung Android smartphone is locked due to forgotten pin pattern and password locked and if you think that you will have to visit to the service center to unlock your smartphone then don't worry at all. Here I am going to tell you how you can unlock your Samsung Android smartphone at the sitting at home without uh, expense any money. Okay. Firstly, when your Samsung Android smartphone is locked, firstly you will have to hard reset of your smartphone and when your hard reset will be done, then after when you will switch on your smartphone, you will get a such type of display. Here you will get welcome pop up, English uh, language option, start option and emergency call. So uh, when I will go with this start option after the hard reset, let's check what happened here when I will go through all the process here. One more thing I would like to tell you my friend, uh, your phone should be connected to the Wi-Fi network. So here you can see I have already connected to my phone to the Wi-Fi network. You can see here so uh, make sure connect your phone to the Wi-Fi network. Then after you will have to tap on this next option. So you can see here after hard reset, it's again asking your pin pattern and password lock. But here you can see there is an another option is showing here use my Google account instead. Simply you will have to tap on this use my Google account. So here you can see it's asking your Gmail ID and password and this page is known as a FRP lock page. If you have your Gmail ID and password, so you can feed here and go through this next option. But if you don't have your Gmail ID and password, so you can see here you are not getting any skip option in this space. So here I will tell you how you will get a skip option on this space to bypass this space because, because without bypass this space, you can't switch on your Samsung Android smartphone. So don't worry at all. This lock is known as FRP lock. You don't have to visit any service center to bypass your uh, Samsung Android FRP bypass. Okay, so firstly you will have to register the starting page. So you can see here this is the starting page. You will have to first change your language from English India to English US. Then after you will have to tap on this OK. Now after that you will have to go to the emergency call option. Here you will have to dial star has zero star has. And when you will feed this star has zero star has you will get a lots of option but you will have to go to the option that will show here sensor and you will get some synchronizing option on your phone display but you can see here your touch will won't work here so don't worry at all here you will have to wait for minimum five second and when your five second uh, will be done you will have to go to the back option now the second option is showing here version simply you will have to tap on this version option and when you will tap on this version option you will get some versions you can see here AP, CP, CSC different type of version will show on your phone display. You can see here you can't do anything on this page again minimum you will have to uh, wait here for minimum 5 seconds then after you will have to go to the back option back option and reach to the starting page here. Now after that you will have to tap on this uh, start option agree to all and go to the agree and you will have to reach to this page you can see here now after that here you will have to switch on your phone's talkback option for this you will have to press the power button and the volume up button press hold and release to activate your phone's talkback option again repeat the process now here you will have to draw a opposite L like this Now here you will have to double tap on while using the app. Now here you will have to double tap on use voice command. Open Google Assistant. Open settings. When your phone setting option will be appear on your phone display, you will have to switch off your talkback option. For this you will have to repeat the process again. And you can see here talkback option has been off. Now after that you will have to make some changes in your setting option. Firstly you will have to tap on this lock screen. 
first one is showing here a screen lock type when you will tap on this one you can see here it's not working then don't worry at all you will have to tap on this option nine times one two three four five six seven eight and nine okay now after that you will have to scroll down you will have to go to the option that will show here face recognition you will have to tap on this one and you will get a pop-up of continue simply you will have to tap on this continue option seven times two three four five six and seven now after that go to the back option now again you will have to repeat the process in with fingerprint option you will have to tap here seven times one two three four five six seven now after that go to the back option here now you will have to tap on this about lock screen and you will have to open this uh, source license here you will get a lots of text on this page but you will have to reach here to this web address and you will have to copy this web address now after copy this web address you will have to exit from setting option and you will have to reach here now after that you will have to tap on this add network option here you will have to go to the setting option now when you come in this setting option you will have to scroll down you will have to go to the reset to default setting tap on this reset keyboard setting reset here now you will have to tap on this erase personalized prediction erase this one go to the back come on this option language and types tap on this manage input language switch on all the languages where the english is showing english us uk and another english is showing here tap on this one go to the back option back now after that you will have to come on this text shortcut add here now here you will have to type all samsung frp Now here you will have to paste that web address and you will have to tap on this add option. Now after that go to the back. Now all the settings has been done. Now you don't have to do anything. Go to the back option, back option and reach to the starting page. Now after that you will have to tap on this start option, agree to all, go to the agree more and agree now after that you will have to tap on this next option <coughs> <coughs> now after that you will have you will have to tap on this don't copy option So here you can see you are getting here a skip option on the page where the Gmail ID and password was asking. Now you can easily bypass this page. It means your phone FRP has been completely bypassed. Now you don't have to visit the service center to bypass your FRP lock of your Samsung Android smartphone. Simply you will have to tap on this skip option. Skip here. Now go to the more accept. If you want to use new pin pattern and password lock then you can use from here but right now I will skip this uh, option here. Go to the OK. go to the next skip from here you will get a pop-up that you are all set up and you will have to tap on this finish option agree select your language here continue select your gender your race criteria
So here you can see the Samsung Android smartphone uh, of any series has been unlocked and uh, FRP bypass has been completely done you can see here so if your phone is also unlocked and FRP bypassed with the help of this video then do the like this video and if you're stuck in this method I mean to say if you're stuck in this FRP bypass method then make us comment our team will definitely respond on your comments so thank you so much.